Welcome to Curie Electronics. Today we are going to solve remaining 40 questions of IPRC question paper. How many layers of PN junctions are used in how many layers of PN junctions are used in SCR fabrication? You know uh, SCR is a PN PN device so it has got three junctions and four layers so what is the answer four layer three junctions a damping in PMMC meter is done by uh, the damping uh, is done by the aluminium frame used for moving coil winding what happens uh, on the aluminium frame eddy current will be developed that will act as damping damping force that will create the damping force if the output is low when one or more inputs are zero the gate is you know for the AND gate if any one of the input is zero or both the inputs are zero or if it, if it is a multiple uh, if it's more inputs AND gate then a number of then also if all inputs are zero the output is zero so it's a it's an AND gate find the current I1 in the circuit so the given circuit uh, as per the what is the uh, Kirchhoff's law first law algebraic sum of current entering a node equal to algebraic sum of uh, current leaving the node so if you calculate it it should come 60 amps but whatever the options are given 60 amps is not there so uh, this question is wrong calibration of measuring device is normally carried by uh, it's a comparison method dash are an example of a combinational circuit this counters flip-flops shift registers all are based on the uh, these flip-flops so it is it is uh, that is those are sequential circuits some multiplexers are the combinational circuit what kind of program status weight flags remain unaffected uh, by the data transfer instruction in the 8051 microcontroller if you do the data trans transfer function the PSW means program status word register nothing is going to change so all of the above auxiliary uh, this is the parity flag auxiliary flag carry flag these are not going to change which among the which among the following is not a passive component transistor we know transistor is an active component when a negative voltage feedback is applied to an amplifier its bandwidth increases and gain decreases which of the following which of the device is opto coupled track BT136 is not an opto coupled track but it's a track this is a transistor this is the opto driver possibly this could be the answer but I even I am not sure whether this is the answer or not because I couldn't find any data sheet for this device but anyway first three are not the answer Critical aspects, aspects of soldering are surf, surface preparation, temperature control, time taken for soldering, all the above. These all are important for proper soldering. Usually batteries, uh, usually dash batteries are used in UPS systems, that's the lead acid batteries. If you like these videos, please share with your friends and don't forget to hit the like button so that the popularity increases. And gate and gate will function as a OR gate if what is there if the both the inputs and outputs if we complement then we can convert an OR gate to AND gate. So how we get I have mentioned here as per the D Morgan's theorem all the inputs and outputs are complemented.
how to improve the problem of frequency drift in lc oscillator using high q coils and good quality capacitors which of the following circuit has output depends only on present input that is a combinational circuit output depends only on the present input the number 1 2 3 is not a valid number in which of the base system if the base is 2 then what is the what are the two numbers used to base 2 base 2 means we use 0 and 1 uh, if it is base 3 then we should use 0 1 2 not 3 so in that case this this the number 1 2 3 is not a valid number in which of the base system base 3 if it is base 8 means base 8 means what are the numbers this is 3 okay base 8 means what are the numbers there uh, it is 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 up to 7 like that which is the drain current in JFET Electro, electron flow from source to drain that is the drain current the input stage of an op amp is usually a dash it's a, a differential amplifier we have a differential input so it's a differential amplifier in a series rlc circuit at resonance at resonance at resonance what is happening here if you look at this graph current is maximum current is maximum so this is wrong impedance is maximum if you want to get the current maximum that means impedance is minimum and then the third point at resonance uh, impedance is equal to only the resistive components of the circuit so this is also wrong then the right answer is admittance is maximum in a transistor if beta equal to 100 and collector current is 10 milliamps then i i is the sum of ib and ic how do you know it is very so then what is the value it is between i and ic very only slight variation is there very little value variation is there so it is i am not calculating it it is 10.1 milliamps we need not to calculate for that it is very simple so it is 10.1 milliamps what is the percentage of charge accumulated by a by the capacitor at the end of two time period you see after two time period it is charge is accumulated 86.4 percent first time period it is 63.2 what is the current rating of of voltage regulator ic lm 317 l it is 100 milliamps 100 milliamps so it is 0.1 amps specific gravity of electrolyte in fully charged lead acid battery is 1.28 is our direct questions which of the following is not a type of inverter we have square wave inverter sine wave inverter modified sine wave inverter but not triangular wave inverter how are the status of the carry auxiliary carry parity flags are affected after the execution of the following instruction in 8051 microcontroller so what is there on the accumulator we are loading move a comma hash 9 ch so in the accumulator we are loading 9 c 9 c mentioned then to that accumulator value we are adding 64 h if you add what is happening after 4 bit addition we are getting one auxiliary carry then carry also getting so we can simply look at for the option which has got carry equal to 1 auxiliary carry equal to 1 that is available the option c is the right answer 
Calculate the multiplier resistance required to measure 50 volt in ne 100 milliamp meter with coil resistance 1000 ohm or 1 kilo ohm. Now I don't remember any equations, so what I'll do? I'll this is the this 1 kilo ohm is 1 kilo ohm connected with this 10 milliamp. 10 milliamp means when full then 10 milliamps currents this this meter gives full scale deflection. So if you now if you try to measure a voltage, what is the maximum it can measure? That is Ohm's law V equal to I into R one volt. One volt. But what is the voltage we have to measure? Not one volt. It is ten volt. That's a mistake. It's a ten volt. Ten volt. Now, what is the voltage we want to measure? We need to measure 50 volt. So V, I will take it as 50. I, I remains same only. 10 multiplied by 10 to the power minus 3 multiplied by R. Then you will get 5 kilo ohm. Now, what is the R required to make this meter 50 volt meter? That is 5 kilo ohm minus 1 kilo, 4 kilo ohm. So if we add a 4 kilo ohm. Uh, resistance in series with this circuit it becomes a 50 volt uh meter voltmeter so the answer is 4 kilo ohm the capacitor c is charged through resistor r and the time constant of the charging circuit is given by rc t equal to rc the input impedance of transistor connected in dash arrangement is highest that is a common collector has got the highest input impedance find the capacitance of two plates 10 cm by 10 cm separated by a distance of 5 mm with air as dielectric so here uh, what is the equation for capacitance C equals a epsilon naught upon D. Here he has given us 10 centimeters, so we can write it in meters. How do you write it? Divide by 100. So 0.1 multiplied by 0.1. This is the area, okay? And what is the value of permittivity? 8.85 multiplied by 10 to the power minus 12 farad per meter upon D. What is the distance? 5 mm. So we have to convert it into meter. Point zero point zero zero one. Is it right or not? If you multiply this uh, meter by thousand, you will get okay. It's right. Now we have to simplify this. What we will do? We will multiply by thousand this entire thing. Denominator and numerator multiply by thousand. Uh, so then, what do you get? You will get eighty-eight point five multiplied by ten to the power minus twelve. Minus twelve don't do anything because answer is in PF. Then one. No, no, no. This is five. Correct. One second. This is a uh, five meter, not five mm, not one mm. So it is. Ah, zero zero five. So we here we'll get five also when you multiply by thousand. Ah, uh, now approximately what value we'll get? Ten times ah uh, seventeen seventeen point something we should get. So we can check it as roughly seventeen point something into ten to the power minus twelve. That means seventeen pf. So. 17 pf is 17.7 pf is the right answer the term triac stands for triode for alternating current what is the unit of electric charge coulomb which type of tv offers the highest resolution currently available We have 4K, 8K. Then it is 8K is higher number of pixels. So 8K 
टी वी वॉट इज द कट ऑफ फ्रीक्वेंसी ऑफ एंड ऑप एम्प इफ द यूनिटी गेन फ्रीक्वेंसी इज वन पॉइंट फाइव मेगा हर्ट्स एंड ओपन लुप गेन इज वन फॉलोड बाई फाइव जीरो नो दिस इज दिस इज रिलेटेड टू द गेन बैंड विद प्रोडक्ट सो वन पॉइंट फाइव मेगा हर्ट्स इज द गेन बैंड विथ गेन बैंड विथ प्रोडक्ट दैट इज इक्वल दैट इट कैन दैट इज गेन मल्टीप्लाइड बाई फ्रीक्वेंसी ना वॉट इज द गेन ही हेज गिवन ना फ्रॉम द यूजिंग द सेम इक्वेशन ए वी एफ वी कैन फाइंड आउट द गेन बैंड विथ फ्रॉम दैट इफ यू कैलकुलेट यू विल गेट फ्रीक्वेंसी हेज फिफ्टीन हर्ट्स फिफ्टीन हर्ट्स आई एम नॉट एबल टू राइट इट सो आई राइट इट हियर फिफ्टीन हर्ट्स इज द आंसर in a voltage source inverter in a voltage source inverter uh, this is this is also related to the um, driving of induction motor uh, so here in the internal impedance of dc source is negligible if it is a current source uh, then uh, it is infinite it is high very high so here it is the internal impedance of dc source is negligible that is the right answer kirchhoff's second law is based on the law of conservation of energy conservation of energy what is the difference of colpitt's oscillator compared to hartley oscillator all of you know the diagram in colpitt's oscillator it's a uses split capacitor pmmc meters can be used for the measurement of dc only okay this is a permanent magnet moving coil instruments are used only for the measurement of dc this all the previous year questions which current flows in track between mt1 and mt2 that's the main current that's a load current which flows that's a so it is a principal principal current what is the characteristic of instrumentation amplifier low in no high output impedance high input impedance instrumentation amplifiers we used to measure the uh, we used to connect to uh, the sensor output very low sensor outputs so the the instrumentation amplifier should have very high input impedance find out the equivalence capacitor when three nos capacitors are connected in parallel when capacitors are connected in parallel you know ct equal to c1 plus c2 plus c3 so here 3 3 plus 3 plus 3 so it's 9 farad is the right answer i hope this videos are useful to you please share with your friends also don't forget to hit the like button thanks for watching